This is one of the worst pieces of legislation in modern times, Madam Deputy Speaker. And looking over the last 13 years, that says a lot. But it's not just this side of the House who thinks this. This bill has been widely and routinely condemned by the Regulatory Policy Committee, the Equality and Human Rights Committee, the Joint Committee on Human Rights, NHS providers, the rail industry, the CIPD, the CEO of the Confederation of Recruitment Companies, the CEO of the NHS Confederation, President Biden's Labour Secretary, the ILO, all UK trade unions, the TUC, the Welsh and Scottish Government, the former Secretary of State, the member for North East Somerset, the member for Stevenage, the Transport Secretary, the Education Secretary. What a shambles. If it wasn't so serious, it would be a joke. From a government that is desperately trying to distract from the 13 years of its own failings and playing politics with key workers' lives. This bill is shoddy, unworkable and unnecessary for the sake of every nurse, teacher and firefighter across the UK and for the sake of our British democratic institutions. I urge the whole House to join us in supporting the thoughtful and sensible amendments from the other place and to vote down the Government's vindictive motions tonight.